action. Hello, this is Richard Collins in Oklahoma City. Perhaps you have one of these beautiful Xerox phasers, 36, 35, or there's many other models, and you're not able to connect your copier and your computer together. Well, you need to put your, your copier in a DHCP mode, and then it will automatically connect for you. So you need to come over here to log in, log out. Then you need to come over here to keyboard, and then one, 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 enter. And you're gonna see this green is lit up, admin. That means you can change some settings. Go to machine status, go to tools, and now you need to go to connectivity and network setup. Push that, network settings. Now you need to go to network setup, and you TCP IP options. And then you need to go TCP IP, ah, TCP IP setup. There. Now you'll see di dynamic addressing. And you notice on this machine it's disabled. Well, you want to put it on. You want your DCP, uh, DHCP enabled. So you're going to push this button. Save. Close, 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 close. And just log out. Now you should, now your machine is in DHCP, so it should be a lot easier to connect your computer and your copier. Your computer should recognize the copier now.